the next level would be is instead of just letting the bell drop passively, we're going to like actively accelerate the bell on the way down. Okay, so this is like a partner assisted swing is what we would call this. So this is going to give you a faster up snap. Um, and the idea is like the, a concentric, so the raising portion contraction is like, there's like research that backs it up. You know, they do research with like, where they do like depth jumps off of a box onto the ground and up to another box. So you can jump higher. Um, so that would be the concentric part where you're jumping. If, you're, if, you, if it's preceded by a fast eccentric contraction, which is like absorbing the force on the ground, then just going from a dead stop is the concept. So like, that's what we're going to do when we do this. The idea being we're going to like force that bell down and like toss it backwards, and then it's going to give us a stronger up snap on the way back up. Okay? So let's give it a try. So here's what the partner drill is going to look like. Chris is going to do two swings by himself, just regular. I'm going to give him some help, and, and I'm going to go from the front. Can you guys see that? So I'm going from the front here, not from the side, so I throw him off. Just enough to really give him, I'm going to give him two more, about five. And now he's going to do five more. He's going to try to get even more stronger swing on the way back up, okay? And so that's a partner-assisted swing right there. Good job, Chris. Nice work, nice work. A couple other things. Like I said, you don't want to be from the side and going like this, because then the belt, then you, can, you don't want to be throwing them that direction. You know what I mean? Also, make sure, like, think about where you're kind of aiming the kettlebell. Like, if you push, I see some people will go like this, and they'll kind of push down towards the ground, and then it'll rip the people down like this, you know? So you want to be, make sure that you throw it back so it gets them in a good path with the bell. And give them just enough so you're not, I mean, you're not trying to make them do like a somersault or anything like that. You just want to just give them some assistance as they go down each one. So it's two by, two by himself, then he's going to do five with the assistance, then you're going to do five more on your own. So let's give it a try.